It's week five of Dana White's Contender Series. Here we are. We are in the Bantamweight division. We have Ramon Tavares. He's taking on Siri City. This is probably the uh, going to be the most fun matchup on the card by my estimations anyway. Uh, in this one here, City is 5-0 and in the last five. Four and one for Tavares. Um, for Tavares, good. So first things first, I want to mention this. Tavares, his record is good. He's fought some weird competition, like really low level, and it's I couldn't find his loss, the one loss he has. I could not find that on the internet anywhere. So I don't really know. But if in the wins, he's looked very good but against low-level competition. So let's break this down. He has very good striking, and he has fast hands. That is not going to change whether he's fighting good competition or bad competition. The hand speed's still there. He does have a really nice cross, but he fights out of the southpaw stance, which makes him tricky for a lot of guys. And he's going to use this cross as a counter to the leg kick a lot of times. So when opponents throw the leg kick, he's going to see that coming, boom, come right over the top with that southpaw cross, and he's going to land that. And when, once he knocks guys down, he usually lets them right back up because he's very quick in the striking, like I said, and that, that cross is coming out like a laser. Now, he's going to move forward and pressure his opponents, but when he's doing it, he's throwing counter shots. He's coming in, using that boxing. He's predominantly a boxer, and he's using that boxing with those counters as he's coming forward. But once he's got his opponent thinking boxing, What's he going to do? Well, he's going to slam a body kick, and he's got a very good body kick as well. Now, when it comes to the grappling, there's not a ton of footage out there, especially not against anybody that's any good. So from what I could tell, he looks like he can grapple pretty well, but it's against low-level competition, and there's just not a lot of it. So he does seem to have a pretty good sprawl, and on that sprawl, he starts looking for front chokes like the Dars, et cetera. Uh, but he starts doing that right away, and that's a, that's a good sign, especially because he's going up against a guy who can grapple in Siri City. Now, for City, City's a good striker as well. Probably not as clean in the boxing, but he still does have some nice, clean, straight shots, and he'll bring them both to the head and the body. Mixes it up well, does a good job there. Now, he also has got good forward pressure, but manages his range well. He, even when he's pressuring forward, he's able to keep opponents at the range he wants them, whether that be all the way out, land those big straights, or all the way in when he's looking for the takedown, because he does have good grappling. He's got a good body lock takedown, and he's also kind of got a good... Um, ability to catch kicks and use those for the takedown. I don't know that he's going to get a lot of that here. Like I said, it's primarily boxing from Tavares uh, or Tavares. Uh, anyway, uh, he's got a good, he's got the ability to catch the kicks if it does come his way. When he gets on top, he's got pretty good control. Um, with that, he's what he does as well is he changes position as his opponents try to scramble out. It just kind of floats into the next position and uses that to control. I do think that's something that he can have some success with here if he is able to get the fight to the mat. We just got to find out if he can get it there. Now, he does have effective ground and pound as well. He lands shots well, and he doesn't really just throw that barrage. He looks for the shots, picks them, and then opens up with the ground and pound. Um, he does have good takedown defense as well. So if he needs to sprawl, start working those underhooks, whatever he's going to do, he has that in case the, the, the takedowns are being done to him. Realistically, though, I do think that the striking is probably just a little bit cleaner out of uh, Tavares here, but uh, City has good enough to make, you know, to make do and do well enough on the feet that I think his edge in the grappling is going to get it done for him. So for me, Siri City's the pick. Like this video on your way out. Thank you so much for watching. I'll see you in the next one.